Good morning and welcome to today's update. Of course, this is a market open update that we do every single day or at least most days. And this time we're covering what we are seeing when it comes to the price of AMC and the data. Now, I know that a lot has gone on with AMC's earnings in the last 24 hours. And yes, I'm going to dive into that in great detail in the next day or so. Of course, the next trading day as in where we are coming up to today. But right now, I want to take a quick few moments to go into what we are seeing. So hopefully this one will be coming at you at the time of open, if not a couple of minutes afterwards. But this is what we're seeing so far for the pre-market market now we're going to start off with the data that we have for the shares available to borrow for right now which is 650k the borrow fee for the for these is about 0.8 so that's a quick picture of what we're seeing for that data by the way if you do enjoy these videos make sure to smash that like button and subscribe but do remember this is my opinion and not financial advice now the next thing that we're going to be, of course, looking at is pre-market. Now, pre-market is really, really funny for today. Pre-market is down by 1.31%. Is it a big amount? No. But should it be down at all? Also, no. We had some great news yesterday. Again, I'm going to be diving into that in, in a bit of detail, so I don't want to go into too much detail in this episode on it. But if anything, AMC should be up big both today, but also in the pre-market already. And what we've seen is we've seen AMC's pre-market doing okay, and then it's just fallen off of a cliff. Now, the reason why, of course, there isn't really one when it comes to the fundamentals. So it's really funny because initially the whole argument against AMC was that the fundamentals were weak. But now that the game has been flipped on its head and fundamentals are strong, all of a sudden fundamentals don't matter anymore. And that's what I think is really quite funny. Now, what we have here is going to be the data from the Ortex guy. This is JD Ruckus, who is on Reddit, and he says this, Ortex guy here with your closing bell for yesterday. So yeah, we haven't had the opening bell update yet, but this is what we have from yesterday. Again, hopefully it will not have changed by too much, but we'll have a look at the main pieces in here. So SI is staying above 20 while the utilization is still maxed. Current mood, I'm not sure if I attract crazy or if I make them that way. And what we see is the figures, we're seeing a short interest of around 20.16%, we're seeing a uh, short interest increase of, zero, of plus 0.28, we're seeing a number of shares shorted being at about 103.27 million, um, and we'll have a look at these figures, you know, the morning figures in a bit, but so far the figures are still looking strong. And again, I do not want to spend too much time speaking about stuff for other episodes in this video, but it is meant to be a quick summary of what we're seeing today uh, so far and what we're expecting for the rest of the day. Now, here's where things get interesting when we look at the chart. Now, as I've said before, they do try and bring AMC down over time, I think. I think they try and look at bad news to do this. And of course, in the markets as a whole, there has been a lot of bad news. But we've had a lot of good news related to AMC specifically, which really is, you know, a point which cannot be denied. You can't really argue against the whole AMC um, movement anymore because the data is looking very, very, very strong. So where is the argument against this company right now? I can't see one. I can't see a reason to bring this one down today. Maybe they will try it, but I think right now it is just pointless because, again, we've heard the numbers from Adam Aaron himself from his mouth. That's all we needed to hear. We know how things are right now. So what's it going to be? That's a question. What is today going to be? Anyway, it's only a matter of minutes until we find out. Of course, I will be updating you guys throughout the day with new stuff because, again, there's a lot to break down, a lot to talk about. So hopefully you'll join us for that sort of stuff too. But for now, I'm going to say goodbye. So thank you so much for joining me. See you again in a bit. Well, thank you for watching through till the end. But let me tell you about our Discord. So on your screen you will be seeing the end to Finance Discord, obviously it is split into multiple sections, basically at the top we have updates from me and all that kind of good stuff, if you scroll down a bit further we have the main sections where we focus on cryptos, SPACs and other hot stocks including penny stocks, even stable growth stocks as well and we even have a special AMC GME chat. If you scroll down you can see some research and DD from the community, we also have funny memes and you can see actual contributions from members down here and again if you do join us it is a completely free link is down below but if you do want to become a patreon you will actually get a pink uh, sticker which will be displayed on your name so your name will come up in pink as mine comes up in red down here and that will show that you are a patreon but other than that guys you can join completely for free down below you do not have to pay anything if you do not want to thank you for watching see you soon